First of all, we have to make the dough. So, sift half a kilogram of white flour into a bowl. Now, in uh, 250 milliliters of warm water, add a teaspoon of salt and uh, mix until the salt is completely dissolved. Add the flour to the salted water and knead the dough. Cover with a bowl and uh, set aside for 20 minutes. After 20 to 30 minutes, lightly sprinkle the dough with flour and uh, roll it into a rectangular thin layer. Cut 100 grams of butter. Now let's melt the butter. Grease the dough with butter. Twist the dough into a roll. Uh, twist the roll a little. Add the roll into equal parts. It all depends on what size samsa you want to make. I made 12 pieces. Now we put each slice in a cut and give it a slight press. Now it's time to put the pieces of dough on a cutting board, cover with cling film and put it into the freezer for 30 minutes or into the refrigerator for 2-3 hours. You also can leave the dough for samsa in the refrigerator for longer. Then we prepare 500 grams of onion. We wash it and uh, cut into cubes or thin half rings. Cut the beef. You can cut large pieces as you like. And, uh, it is important to choose beef without veins. We put the meat in a bowl with onion and uh, salt it with uh, one and a half teaspoon of salt. Add half a teaspoon of black pepper and we add a teaspoon of slightly ground zero. Mix well, cover and put aside. We take out the dough from the refrigerator and uh, roll each piece into a thin round circle, one millimeter thick. Put the stuffing in the center of each piece and connect the edges so that you get a triangle. The samsa can be made in any shape, triangular, round or rectangular.
Now we put the samsa on a baking tray with a seam down. Grease with yolk. Sprinkle with black sesame seeds. Just a little bit. Send it to a well preheated oven at a temperature of 180 200 degrees Celsius for about 30 minutes to golden color. Puff pasture samsa can be served as a hot meal or with soup.